pen pals, prepare yourselves for the mystery, excitement, and intrigue of this month's electrifying top five pens. August is usually considered a slow month for the business, yet there wasn't a shortage of new pens to talk about. But before I do, a quick disclaimer. These top five pens are based on sales, likes, comments, and customer reviews on goldspot.com during August 2022. This isn't my personal top five list or grace of all time list. It's a list created by you, the fine people of the online pen community. Iguana Blue is the latest addition to the Caveco AL Sport Collection and our fifth most popular pen in August 2022. At this point, I think Caveco knows that pen lovers enjoy buying new, colorful pens, even if they're the same model. The Caveco Collection introduces fun styles available for a limited time. Iguana Blue follows up the successful sold-out AL Sport releases of Golden Espresso and Vibrant Violet. Like those pens, Iguana Blue consists of matte finished anodized aluminum with gold-toned appointments. The pocket-sized Sport is compact with a faceted cap shape that prevents the pen from rolling off the table. Unscrewing the cap one full turn reveals the front grip section and gold-plated number five size stainless steel nib with a black plastic feed. With tip options ranging from extra fine to double broad, it's easy to find a nib that works best for you. The Caveco AL Sport includes a single international ink cartridge to start. If you prefer filling with bottled ink, Caveco does offer a sport piston converter that is sold separately. Or you could syringe fill your ink cartridge as I show you in the demonstration on our YouTube channel. Overall, I think Iguana Blue is my favorite color of the Caveco AL Sport collection so far. And as far as I could tell, many of you agree. You can find our fifth most popular pen on Goldspot for $92 until the edition is finished. We're moving from aluminum to copper with our fourth best pen of August, the Retro 51 Tornado Nikola Tesla Rollerball Pen. Inspired by the spiral coil used in wireless power experiments, Retro 51 designed the tapered barrel with a mesmerizing acid etched pattern of concentric circles. For a radiant and magnetic aesthetic, Retro 51 finished the barrel in polished copper with platinum appointments. The pen has an engaging texture that adds to the feel of the writing experience. A portrait of Tesla looks back at you from the top disc as if to ask, what have you invented today? Tesla's portrait is also on the matching commemorative tube that also doubles as a pen stand when the pen is not in use. The Tornado writes with a Ref5P capless rollerball ink cartridge with a spring. You can customize the Tornado with a Parker style type ballpoint refill or by hacking the capless cartridge to write with fountain pen ink. I'll show you that in a hack video, the card above. Usually a Retro 51 Tornado has to be a limited edition to make a monthly top five list. Tesla is actually a regular catalog item and is not limited or numbered in any way. You can purchase the fourth most popular pen of August on our Goldspot website for $54. Now, here is a limited edition design that won't be around for long. Showing in third place is the Navalor Nautilus fountain pen in style of Fora Berry. Navalor introduced this design during the DC Pen Show weekend. If you saw last month's top five, Navalor took the top spot with the wild multicolored Grand Rhapsody design. Style of Fora Berry is much more elegant and subtle in its presentation. For this pen, Navalor chose an ebonite body with deep aubergine swirls and striations. To complement the warmth of the material, they trimmed the pen in rose gold appointments. One of the neat features of the Nautilus is the porthole ink window that allows the writer to see ink remaining in the pen. The piston fill mechanism operates smoothly and fills the pen with an ample volume of ink. Despite the company's rebranding, this model still has Narwhal on the decorated cap band and the original logo on the nib. Speaking of the nib, you can access the writing end by unscrewing the cap two full turns. The Nautilus has an ample tapered grip section that flares slightly at the end. Here you'll find the number six size stainless steel nib plated in rose gold. Although some of the nib sizes are already sold out, this pen was originally offered in fine, medium, broad, double broad, or 1.1 millimeter stub. If you'd like to see a writing sample of each size, check out the Narwhal nib comparison video on our channel. The Nautilus Style of Fora Berry is a limited release that is going fast. If you love the color of Ebonite and have $160 in the fountain pen kitty, be sure to claim the number three pen of August 2022 before you miss out. 
Speaking of missing out, if you didn't purchase the number two item on this month's top five list, you did miss out because it is sold out. The Goldspot Pens Mystery Dip Surprise Box made a comeback this month. I'll share the contents to let you know what was inside. Each Mystery Dip Box came presented in a black Goldspot gift box branded with a foil embellished Goldspot logo. Lift the magnetic flap to uncover the mystery inside. Included in the box is the Estabrook Camden in one of the original three colors. Here I have the silver. There was also a rose and a graphite black. A converter is also included so the writer may fill their Estabrook Camden with one of five random ink samples included in the box. An international ink cartridge is also available as well as an Estabrook polishing cloth that were also included. And what made the mystery so attractive was the price. True, you did not know what you were going to get, but we wanted to make sure that you got a great deal nonetheless. The Camden pen itself lists for $195 retail price. So at $99 for the entire box, many of our customers felt the risk was worth the reward. This box received 19 five-star ratings, including comments like, a wonderful surprise, well worth it, fun, I literally squeed. For those of you who don't know what a squee is, it goes something like this. <coughs> so although you may have missed out on the August mystery dip, fear not pen friends, there shall be more in the future. We're aiming for a quarterly schedule, which means that we should have a new one right around in time for the holidays. I can't think of any better surprise for pen enthusiasts. So sign up for the weekly email newsletter so you don't miss out on the next one. At numero uno, we have the Leonardo Officina Italiana Momento Zero Carreta Sea Turtle Fountain Pen version 2.0. If you remember way back in January of this year, we sold out of the first edition that had rhodium silver trim. That edition was limited to 90 pieces individually numbered on the cap. Now, Coretta 2.0 uses the same Arco-styled stacked acrylic resin paired with blue PVD appointments instead of the rhodium. This Gold Spot exclusive design is limited to 180 pens with the number and a sea turtle symbol engraved on the back of the cap. Unscrewing the cap one full turn reveals the tapered grip section and a blue PVD number six size Yovo stainless steel nib. Unlike the typical Memento Zero nib, this nib unit housing is affixed to the grip section and cannot be unscrewed out. If a nib swap or cleaning is required, the nib and feed can be pulled straight out, like so. The nib housing is fixed in the grip section because Leonardo intentionally set the entire pen so that the chatoyant sides of the acrylic would be aligned with each other and the face of the nib. Now it is possible to thread the cap on in three different spots, two of which will misalign the design, like so. I'll show you a trick how to align the cap and barrel when you close the pen. If you put the cap on and the colors are not aligned, then you'll want to turn the cap as if you're removing it from the pen, but keep the cap on. When the cap hits the next thread, it will click and you'll feel it. Then twist the cap back on as if you're going to cap the pen to see if it lined up. If not, then repeat the process one more time and you'll be there. You can fill the Momento Zero using the included converter that can be accessed by unscrewing the grip section from the barrel, or you could unscrew the blind cap to activate it like you would a piston fill pen. At the time of this recording, we're nearly sold out of the Coretta version 2. Only a few extra finds are left, of which I have this one. However, we've only received one part of the 180 piece order and we're expecting the balance of the shipment in the next two weeks. So if you sign up for an in-stock notification on the nib size you desire, you'll receive an email when we get our next and final shipment. When the last of the Coretta pens arrive, you'll find the number one pen of August 2022 for $199 exclusively on the Goldspot Pens website. There you have it, Pen Pals, your top five pens of August 2022. Which is your favorite of this month's selection? Discuss it in the comments below. Sad to say, you'll probably see less video and social media content from us in September. No, I didn't get fired. It's catalog crunch time. Chris, Josh, and I are busy building the new issue that is due to be mailed in November. As you can imagine, it's a lot of work. So we are pouring all of our energy into making the best pen publication on the planet. If you'd like a copy when they're ready to mail, please use the Google form link in the description below to provide your mailing address. If you're a recent Goldspot Pens customer in the USA, you'll most likely get a copy mailed to you already, so there's no need to request it. Everyone else, please fill out the form and we'll put you on the list.
If you'd like to see a flip through of last year's catalog, you can watch this live stream video here. If you love Leonardo pens and flexible nibs, you may want to check out this video here. Subscribe to the Goldspot Pens channel to keep in touch about all the latest and greatest in fine writing. Thank you for watching and stay inky, my friends. Take care.